would walk out that way as oh, best sorry. you can. Okay, that's good. Uh, what you need to do is you need to pick up this lunchbox that we launched into near space. And I'll take this. The balloon lifting it. Stop. The cameras inside it. The little spaceman we attached to it. Larry, are you gonna come back? <laughs> For weeks after we launched it, All right. we seriously thought we'd never see it again. We did this to see if we could, and we wanted to see for ourselves what it looks like more than a dozen miles above the surface of the Earth. Let's go back to the beginning. It's stinky up there. When that stuff comes down and you smell it, it, it stinks. What does it smell like? I, I, it, like space. It just stinks. <laughs> I don't... We asked Charlotte Space Exploration to help with the research. We are launching a balloon into high altitude. And we asked August Flassig and Hackerspace Charlotte to help build it. This is my first balloon launch that I would be doing personally. August wanted one specific thing. I want some pictures where I can see the Earth curve. To get that video, we'd have to do three things. Get it off the ground, track it in the air, and find it when it came down. Camera one goes in here. This guy comes in here, mounted down. We have a four foot chute. Throw our heater and our battery down in here, and our radios go up on top. It's designed to pop at about 100,000 feet. We'll be happy we get 60, that'd be good. Well, I think the worst part of it is, is there's no going back and saying, I forgot to turn on that switch. Once it leaves your hand, you don't have another choice. How are you feeling about this? Oh, I'm nervous as all hell. Oh boy. Yes. So it'll lift up bags and the, and the ruler, please. When we fill it, it's going to be about, oh, about six feet across. Let's crack the tank. When it actually gets up to altitude, it's going to be about 30 feet across. That cinch that baby down. Start him. All right. Yeah. Good luck, little guys. <laughs> you want to glue his face on? Yeah. We have a payload in the air. The bobblehead's bobbling. I will love to have a space cookie. There she is. 1,226 feet, 2 miles an hour, 168 degrees. Ah, it looks about right. Well, I guess it's time to go out uh, running after it. We thought the balloon would travel roughly 60 miles. We're about 15 minutes in, we're tracking it live, and it's about 7,000 feet up already, and it's almost over Rock Hill. It went much, much further. The first problem, the jet stream. At one point, the balloon was moving at 80 miles per hour. We are about two hours after launch. Brad, where is the balloon right now? Right now, it is east of King Road in Scotland County. We couldn't keep up. We're, we're right now in Union County, coming up on the Anson County line. It is about 125. We are just south of Fayetteville, and the balloon just popped. And it's descending um, pretty quickly. It's down to 63,000 feet. It got up to about 103. Is this 95 right here? Yep. Okay. And then the bigger problem. Damn. We couldn't find it. Yeah. <laughs> this looks like a hike. We knew it landed on this hunting preserve 10 miles west of Goldsboro. Slightly more efficient. Yes. <laughs> Remember how we thought it would go 60 miles? Yeah, it went 172. So we did what tired people do in this situation. We gave up. So is this kind of like a needle in a haystack? I was going to say, I know. <laughs> it's like, isn't this nuts? Our group made six long cross-state trips to go look for it. We even went up in a plane each time. What was the verdict? Nothing. We had one last idea. And we are about to get into Airstar to go look for the weather balloon. I, I see something down there. It's yellow. Look down here in that field. I think that's it, man. Of course it is. What else is out here? I, I honestly thought it was going to be in a tree. So did I. Oh, God. Yeah, that's all it is. All right, hold on. This thing could have been... What do you think this? Oh, good job. You're good. Oh. Ah. Oh. Holy crap. Larry's still there. Larry is still in attached. In his face. Larry is still attached. That's funny. That is unbelievable. If you were looking out here just casually, you, you would never have come with a million hunter, feet of this. I don't care if you're a hunter or not, you wouldn't see it. No. Finally found got it. got it. There she is. Wow. And then we saw the video.
Man always wants to fly, uh, to get up and above, get a view from, 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 from the heights, to actually have a picture where I can sit there and go, here's a picture that I, I worked out getting this thing taken that shows me space and shows me a planet beneath me. <sighs> that's, that's a thrill.